Hey there, it's Vicki Marie, and today we're gonna have a productive day in the life. First, I've gotta run by my sisters and pick up a couple of things, and then I'm gonna go over uh, to Lowe's. I've, I'm gonna pick up a garden cart today uh, for a project John's doing, and we thought it would be a good idea to have a, a, a heavy-duty garden cart, not just for garden work, but when we go camping, we can put things in it. Uh, also, just carrying things. Um, so, so he, we've got an event tomorrow where we're going to be selling some old radio equipment, uh, and it's this. It's kind. It's called like a, a, a ham fest, amateur radio, where you all get together and you you kind of sell some of your old equipment. Anyway, <laughs> that's what we're doing. We have a social hour to go to tonight for that as well. Uh, but anyway, we thought we'd get a garden cart because then we can like it'll help us with different things in our life. So uh, we're gonna I'm gonna do that, and then I've got to pick up a Walmart pickup. Uh, I have that scheduled for noon, so I need to get there between noon and one. So that's what's going on today, and I just thought I'd take you guys along. So let's jump right in. I still have my seats down from when I picked up that furniture. Uh, the dining room tables. I never put my seats back up. I'm gonna do that now. <laughs> I'll touch base with you guys in a bit. Oh my goodness, it is so hot. Um, so I went over to my sister's. I ended up being there a little bit longer than I expected, but we got we had a nice visit. You know, she had moved into her new home and um, she has got it so nice. Everything's so organized and ah, it's like, oh my goodness. Um, I Yeah, I'm like, now I'm kind of like, do you ever feel like that you go visit your sister or your friend and you're like, oh, I need to work on my house. <laughs> That's kind of how I'm feeling because it just looks so nice. Um, but yeah, I'm here, Roscoe and I are here at Walmart and I'm just waiting for my groceries. I'm at like, I had to be here by like one and I'm here at 12.59 and checked in. So uh, I'm just picking up just a few essentials today. That's it. Uh, and I gotta say, I love the convenience that uh, from the Walmart pickup. I don't have to go in the store. I did have a few substitutes, but I did not get a chance to look at them because it came through and I was driving. So I didn't, uh, I didn't look at that. But I did get some, uh, let's see, what did I, oh, I got some broccoli. Just easy, not even fresh, just stuff I can heat up because it's gonna be a busy weekend. I'm trying to eat more vegetables. And um, what else did I, I got, uh, yeah, just basic stuff. So this might be my stuff here, but I'm going to go ahead. No, that's not enough, I don't think. I'll give you guys a closer look, though, when I get home. So, And then I'm going to go over and get up the, that wagon from Lowe's because um, the garden cart, I was going to try to get it before I came to Walmart, but I just had such a good time visiting my sister that I didn't get to do that. So I will, uh, so I think next I'll just check in with you at home, show you what I bought. And then we'll go over and get that garden cart. But I gotta cool down. It is hot. I've got the air on, but it's so hot out here. So this is my grocery haul. I'm here at my house, just pulled into the garage. And they just put the, because we don't have bags here and I didn't bring bags. So I've got some light and fit Greek yogurt and some more of this protein pack uh, power up. I don't know if that's the same brand I had before, but this is the Power Up Premium Trail Mix Protein Packet. These are so good. I just pour a scoop of these into my yogurt in the morning, and sometimes I put a scoop into my oatmeal. I also got some more of this. I talked about this before. This is the one I get. I really like it, and I can just get it in the Walmart pickup for like $8 and something. And I got Roscoe some more food, and they didn't have the exact one I ordered, but they had the be uh, the beef and egg. So this is the dog food I like to get him. And I also bought him some new treats. These are the Full Moon Kitchen Crafted Natural Dog Treats Chicken Strips, 100% USA or yeah USA made human grade dog treats. I think he'll like those. And then I got him these. And these are the wrapped dream bones that I uh, get him all the time that he loves. And speaking of Roscoe, I need to check on him. Okay, yep, I stopped at the store and got myself a big drink of Coke Zero. <laughs> uh, I know. Don't do that. It's not a healthy thing to do. Ha. Huh. But I do it anyway. Okay. It is like my, la my latest advice. Um, here is the broccoli I bought. I just bought three packs of this. 
and I bought some of these. Um, I love these ice creams. I've been I got a couple of those, and I got these. The this is the almond, the mocha almond. It's all it's all. Uh, this is almond milk, and this is coconut milk, and they are so good. And I got some of the thin sliced Dave's Killer Bread, the sprouted whole grains. I got some turkey breasts. I got another thing of creamer, just one for John and one for me. And I got some bananas. And some Coke Zero. There we go. That's my haul, y'all. I have a mess going on back there. <laughs> um, but I just walked in and I, I, I put all the refrigerated stuff away in the froze, the freezer stuff. And I, I just left a couple of things sitting out and I thought, you know what? I've got to turn back around and go out into the heat and pick up, go pick up this, uh, the garden cart from Lowe's. And I haven't pre-ordered it. I just have to go buy it off the shelf the old fashioned way and put it in my cart and I'm not doing a pickup or anything. So I have to actually go in and um, it's hot and I'm tired. And I thought, well, John came home for lunch and he called me up and he said, hey, I'm, I'm at the house. I went by Burger King and got us some Whopper Juniors. Hmm. So yes, I did start off thinking low carb, healthy day, but hmm, I am not turning down a Whopper Junior. So I'm gonna eat my lunch and I set a timer and I thought, you know what? I'm gonna set a 30 minute timer for my lunch break. Even though normally I would be like, oh, let me get this done and this done and then I'll sit down and take a lunch break. Like, no, I'm gonna take a 30 minute lunch break like I used to do when, before I started working for a lunatic, which is me. Like when you're self-employed, you work for a lunatic, in case you didn't know. So I set a timer on my Echo device, and I'm gonna take the next 30 minutes, I'm gonna catch up with a few of my friends on YouTube and watch a few videos, maybe listen to a couple podcasts or something, I'll see. Those, I probably don't have time for podcasts. And I'm gonna eat my hamburger, and then uh, I'll, I'll run out the door and go do my next errand. But you know, in order to be productive, some Sometimes uh, it's like I was saying uh, just on another, I don't know if that vlog came out before this or after, but where we ha we want to set a break every couple hours. If you're, if you were a homemaker and you, okay, well you don't work outside the home. Well, that's a bunch of bull because half the stuff you do is outside the home. Like those terms are so outdated. If you are um, homemaking, that's your job. I mean, everybody, ha whether you get an outside paycheck from somebody else or it comes out of your own finances, you know, you are funding yourself um, for your work. Your work is your work to do. And, and we have to create moments in our day, throughout our day, to take a little break. And I, I, when I got back from camping and I, I did that vlog on the tips for productivity, I'm not kidding. It is important for us to do those simple little things that we know to do. And, and I should know better. And I still don't practice it. So 30 minute timer, taking a break. I'm going to eat and do whatever else I want to do for the next 30 minutes and then I'll be back. Take a break every now and then. Take a lunch break. Take a proper lunch break. Give yourself a lunch break. Even if you work for yourself and you work for a lunatic who works you way too darn hard or you're, you feel like you're a homemaker and you are home all day so you don't deserve a break. Yes, you work your tail off, let me tell you. I work harder now that I don't go to an office than I did when I went to an office. Okay, I'm going to do this and I'll be back. Do you hear that fan? That's my seat cooler. <laughs> so it works really good, but <laughs> um, it makes a lot of noise, I notice. Okay, so um, I got back in the car. I had my lunch break and I answered some comments. I'm getting caught up on some of my YouTube friends. I always, uh, I, if I go, if I feel like if I don't stay on it, I get behind and then just, uh, I don't like to rush through my comments so much. I like to read them. And if I have any questions, I like to answer them and, you know, so, but I spent some time doing that. I actually took a 45 minute lunch break instead of a 30 minute lunch break because I just got so wrapped up in it. Now I am going to head to Lowe's. Ross goes with me. We got cooled off. He loves those treats. I got him the, the chicken human grade treats. Um, I gave him one and he took off with it. He really liked it. <laughs> so. Uh, but yeah, I'm gonna go get a, uh, a card. It's called a, uh, a garden cart, I think. Yeah, garden cart. And it's, I think it's $179. It, I'll, I'll just put a screenshot up here. John sent it, sent it to me and he said, this is the one I want. 
and we're going to be using it for, uh, for other things, but uh, primarily we want it for tomorrow to haul some equipment uh, to, um, we're, we're selling a whole bunch of stuff, like, uh, it's his radio stuff. Uh, that's just stuff that he's accumulated that, uh, that's what, you know, a lot of hobbyists do this. It's like a, remember swap meets where you would just go and sell your stuff and exchange stuff and that kind of thing? Well, that's what, uh, that's what he's doing, so. All right, guys, well, thank you for coming along. <laughs> I'm gonna call him a Robert, Lori. He can't, he's weak, he's weak. Thanks for watching. <laughs> Make sure you subscribe for more, I don't know, more crazy videos. <laughs> we'll see you on the next one. Say bye.